Patriots will look to make history in Super Bowl 53 today, as with a win they will tie the Steelers with six Super Bowl titles, all in the Brady-Belichick era. They will have to take care of the Los Angeles Rams, a high-powered team with a young coach and young quarterback who want to knock New England off their pedestal. Here's three keys as to what the Patriots have to do to win in Super Bowl 53, and a final prediction for the game. 1. Make the Rams one-dimensional There's been plenty of reports, more so since the NFC title game, that Rams running back Todd Gurley is not 100%, and if that is truly the case, the team will be giving a lot more looks to reborn running back CJ. Anderson, who has played well this postseason. If the Pats can early on take that running game away from the Rams, it will force Jared Goff to throw off in, which will play right in the hands of the Patriots and they're looking to get to the quarterback. If the Rams can run the ball, it will open up play action for Goff, and he's very good when it comes to throwing the ball downfield to his receivers off play action. Look for the Pats to try and confuse Goff with different looks, but also look for the Rams to get Anderson and Gurley going early. 2. The Pats' screen game There's no doubt in the two playoff wins thus far the Pats' screen game has been as good as it's been at any point in the last few seasons. The team will have to use that again today against a fierce Rams pass rush, and it wouldn't be a shock to see newly crowned two-time NFL Defensive Player of the Year Aaron Donald to try to get into the backfield and reach Tom Brady early and often, and with that it will open up the Rams pass game. It was the screen game that got the team going a year ago in the Super Bowl, and look for it to be a huge key again today against the really good Rams defense. Three. Set the tempo The Patriots and their fans looked up at the scoreboard last year in Super Bowl 52 with 8.48 to play in the second quarter and found themselves down 15-3. They cannot afford this year to do that against the Rams, who have a much better offense than what the Eagles had a season ago. New England settled for two field goals on their first two scores, which really hurt the team as they trailed 15-6 when just one score would have made a big difference. Scoring TDs and not settling for field goals will be paramount in this game. Prediction, the Patriots are in a good position in this game, they have plenty of confidence after their win over the Chiefs two weeks ago, and they seem poised and confident to put last year behind them and not allow the Rams to get off early in the game, which is a huge key. Look for Tom Brady to avoid that pass rush by stepping up often in the pocket, look for a big game for Tay Rob Grankowski, and look for the team to finally escape last year's demons by scoring touchdowns this time and not settling for field goals. It should be a fun game, and one that will see the Pats hoisting their sixth Super Bowl trophy in the end. New England 34 Los Angeles 26